Welcome back, everyone, to the next installment of Papa Eo. We're trying to guide this monster here, and now we have pieces of the ground just ripped up out of it that lead to white nothingness below? I don't know. I don't know about this. Look up! Can't you see anything special? Which is the good one? I'm gonna see one thing. Can't do much with my robot buddy with it, though. I guess we can just drop in here. Oh, okay. Oh. Man. Oh, I see. I see. We're doing one of these. Got it. That wasn't so bad. Got it. Got it. Alright, that wasn't terrible. Okay, see ya. That's so cool, every single time. I don't know if I want to necessarily pull it up that far, though, but what's down here? Again with these dolls. I wonder if these are supposed to be the hidden hat locations, and it's just telling me, come back here on a second playthrough. Well, anyway, let's go up to where I'm clearly supposed to go because I just unlocked it. And what is this? Alright. That's just a pit. I suppose I could go around that way, but for what purpose? And how do I raise that street more? Or do I even just go across like this? I can, but why? What was the point? There's got to be something I'm missing here. I can't seem to wake up the monster. I don't have any coconuts or frogs. Oh, I was being dumb. Okay, I want to let that thing out a little more horizontally. Well, but even then, though, I don't know about this. It doesn't really look like there's anything up there, either. Do I just fly through this? Does that do anything? Uh, yes, it does. <laughs> ah, that's what that's for. Okay. Oh, hello. Well, I'm higher up. I can get into the, the white void here. I guess the monster will just chill back there. See ya. God knows how he followed me. It's fine. What? Whoa. Oof. I hope you don't have vertigo. Oh man. Where are we? What is happening? Oof. Can I go in the... No, it's just the pipe. Man. 
make the platforms. There's something missing here. Stairs leading up the platforms to the key. Okay. But how do I make this work? Do I leave the monster over here and make him fall asleep? Oh god, this is dizzying. I don't think this is going to solve the problem. No. I am not getting up there. How, where where else can I go? I don't know what else I am supposed to do even. Do I do I actually just I probably just jump on those platforms now that I think about it. I probably have to fall correctly. Okay. Oh good. That's very good. Is there a whoa ho ho Is there a reason to leave the monster over here, I wonder? Oh, I can orient myself. Okay. Got it. That oh that, that disoriented me. I'll wait for that thing to come back down. I don't know if I... Well, maybe I can complete this jumping puzzle here. Or section. I don't know if it's really a puzzle at this point. Yeah, this is doable. It's freaking weird, but it's doable. I feel like I'm playing Alice Madness Returns. Yeah, I'm already almost there. This isn't so bad. Man, I gotta get out of here. This place is too weird. Anyway, I got the key. Oof, sorry, that's literally dizzying. Alright. Oh, I didn't quite make it. Ooh, not quite. Alright, in that case, I'll just go on the higher up area. Oh, this was the place. Okay. How do I get up there, though? Oh, hello. Good, make this even easier. A little less dizzying each time. Oh no, how do I get to the wind-up key? I can't exactly leave the monster here, can I? There's that lower area. I guess I'll fall onto that somehow, if I can make that... Ah, I blew that one. But apparently I can easily fall there if I really want to. So it's not so bad. The bad news is I have to wait for it to come back around. There it goes. Hi. But you can see the thing I pull from under it. Or within it, I don't know. There we go. Good, good, good. This is more like it. Whoa. Maybe that's what I want. I don't know. I do like, though, that I could just move around as I see fit. I guess this is the ultimate exit, but I can't... Whoa. Yeah, but I can't do that yet, I don't think. So maybe I'll just stick with this funky business for now. Because I need to get over there. Although I don't know if I can make that jump. I'm pretty sure I cannot, in fact. Ah, so close. And I wonder, 
that, that was just terrible on my part. I think you might see what I'm trying to do, though. Ah, not quite. I'm trying to sneak into that area with the wind-up key. Beautiful. Gotcha. And now I can move this thing, too. Yeah, see the stairs lead here? This is how I was supposed to do it, but I kind of cheated. Let's fall to my death. And now... Am I allowed to pass through these bars? Yes, I am. The monster can't because he's too big. Good, I think I might have this in the bag. I think I went around the long way, but it's fine. Ah, didn't make it back, but it doesn't matter. This will soon be solved. I don't know what's up with those frogs. Oh, I'm gonna have to lure the monster over here, I'm sure. Are you kidding me? They're messing with me right now? Oh, is he gonna get mad? Great. Now I gotta put up with this. Puzzle solved. That's a lot of frogs. Can I just go? That's looking like a no. Lula. Well... The monster's mad at me, but it looks like I can go. Oh. Monster killed your Lula. Oh, now we're back here in the kind of regular town, but not really. And we still have pieces of the surreal part. Oh, we're back at the very beginning of the game. So this was a Lula switch the whole time, but I don't have Lula. So I'm pulling this open again for the first time for the second time. But now I have monster in the very beginning of the game, which I did not before. How am I going to make this work? Yeah, it's the same thing as before. Again, with the monster this time. And different music. The monster isn't even sleeping, he's just kind of chilling. Maybe he only sleeps if there's a place for him to rest his head against. Oh, Lula is dead. We must bring Lula to the temple. 
Yeah, it's our only hope. Okay. Well, it's the same area as before, except that it has all this... this different aesthetic now. I wonder what this material is supposed to be. It's a monster zone. Frogs, probably. A frog pipe. In fact, yeah, isn't this where we first saw frogs? Just kind of hanging out? Damn. Yeah. Gotta bring monster over there. Find him. Now how... Well, there's the thing to calm him down, so he's gonna get mad. Great. I could go up these stairs, but I don't know why I would. And I could go down here. Oh boy, this looks interesting. Looks like a soccer field or a... yeah, a soccer field. There's a soccer ball. I gotta open the door. This is a rotten fruit. If a monster eats a frog, you better look for a rotten fruit to calm him down. Yeah, I saw one a while ago. There's one, in fact. I pulled this? Oh, that's crazy. Well, there are the frogs. Oh, that just brings the monster in. And now I run my ass off. Two things need to happen to unlock this door. Each section of the field is like a jar. You can release its contents or trap things in it. things in it. Hey, he's gonna go looking for the frog, sure, but what am I trapping, right? Let me see this. It's just a regular tree. And that's a frog pipe, I guess. There's gotta be some really obvious thing I'm missing here. Oh, there was, actually. But how do I know where I want the monster to stand? Like, does this do it? Oh, that's what it is. It's a monster switch. Oh, I see what it is. Okay, I get it. I get it. I didn't realize if he's standing in the general vicinity, he just disappears into another dimension. Okay, I get it now. Watch this awesome action. You, sir, are coming with me. There it is. Whoa, I didn't know that was a thing. 
He just picks me up and takes the, the coconut. That's fantastic. Actually, now we're doing this. This is probably the other switch, right? Here, you go over there. I quickly put this away. Okay. Here, you come with me. Does this do it? No. Where's the other thing for the door? How do I get this to work? This is frog area, right? Yeah. Now you know what I'll do? Ah, crap, he's mad. That's fine. I'll deal with this in a second. Here, you take this. There. Now this time, I'm going to trap the monster in here. He'll grab this, and I will beam him out of existence, and now I'll reconnect this pipe. And I will spawn the frogs, now that there's no monster to eat them. Because now I can put the frogs on the pipe, presumably. Yeah, see that? He's coming right there to art for me. I think this should work. I hope. Oh my god. That's amazing, but whoa. <laughs> Alright, that does it. Another monster area, another place for frogs. Do I actually... I don't have to take a frog into these other pipes, do I? That'd be such a royal pain. I hope I don't. It doesn't look like it. Let's just go in and see what happens. Where is a thing that I can manipulate? There's the ladder back out there. Well, that's right. This is where I was... Oh, wait. Duh. The whole point was to open that door so the monster could come in. Now I can respawn the monster. I'm not even thinking. The frogs are gone, too, so I should be good to just do this. And now I'll take this. He can follow me. He should be able to fit through here. And I even have a switch, hello, for him to stand on. You coming, buddy? Yeah, don't scare me like that. We're good. Good. It looks like you can get mad again. I really love that. Give me that coconut. There's a frog. I guess, okay, I guess the gimmick here is to get the frogs in the pipes without the monster chasing me, taking the frog from me, and going berserk. This should be a freebie. And it's terrifying. Oh, really? 
Uh, okay. Oh, it teleported me to the other side. Well, now I know how I'm solving this puzzle. I just gotta stay out of the monster's sight while I do this. Frog number two. Yeah, the monster's coming my way. I'll let him get nice and close so I can get to the other pipe easily. Oh my goodness. Here's the other pipe. Oh, he's running up though. I gotta hurry. Are you kidding me? Thanks, game. That's very annoying. Here, pal. New frog spawn, please. New frog spawn, please. There we go. Very irritating. Let's try this again, but this time have it work. So again, I'll let him come to me and scare me by getting too close. And then I leave. And then I hurry. Got it. Oh good, the monster just goes. I was afraid I had to lead him. Now he's gone. Again, such cool art. And he's asleep, that's it. And there he goes. Okay. Well, he's chillin', so for now it is time to stop the installment. Well, we certainly made a lot of progress today, didn't we? We solved still more puzzles with the monster, but unfortunately he went berserk and destroyed Lulu. We may possibly be able to save Lulu and possibly the monster too, if we can bring them to this shaman, but we've got our work cut out for us. Until next time, everyone.